Hello guys, welcome to Congrats Moms channel here in Kenya, Africa. Coming live from I am Marwa's villa, guys. I've visited the villa. It has been long since I came here and uh, I've taken my time to come and see how the villa is going on. I advise pieces of advice so that the owner is not here, so I've just visited the villa. Marwa, I am Marwa's villa to check on few issues, a few things, uh, how the workers are going on, the compound as a whole, and also check on the very important animals, the horses, guys. So welcome to Congress Mom's channel. If it's your first time watching this video, kindly subscribe to the channel, root 50k, guys. So I'm here today in Maros Villa to see how things are moving on here. So welcome. The title of the video is going round in Maros Villa to see how things are moving on. It has been a long time before I came here. Couple of weeks since Maro left Africa have not come here so kindly subscribe to the channel yes let's go around and see what is happening here we have the fish pond this is the fish pond guys look at this Wow, so beautiful. Look how they are moving. So guys, I've been here. Oh, there's no fish here. So not yet. Not yet. So next time when the owner comes, I think, wow, guys, I've not been here. You see, in fact, it has been long. I didn't know that he did all this. In fact, it's my first time to be here since this construction was done. In fact, I've never been here. Wow. See, I've really taken time before I come here, guys. See, I left this place and went back to school where I teach when the Marwa himself had not finished this work like this. You see? This is a project that I left before he did it. And this is congratulations to I am Marwa only be watching this video. I'm so impressed on how you are hard working. Look at this, guys. Uh, in fact, I've not been here. Look at this. Look at this. Yeah, all this is a new project. Yeah. Wow. In fact, I've not been here. Look at this. So interesting, guys. Wow. Well, wherever you are, I'm praying for you and Rocio. May God bless you for the this wonderful work that you are doing in the village. See this? All this. I left and went to where I work before this work was done like this. So I'm so impressed. I'll take time to pray for Marwa and Rocio uh, so that God may give them strength to accomplish this kind of work. Wow, guys. So here I am. Uh, going round to check on what is happening in his compound. So wherever he is, he'll be watching this video. He'll be able to know today my mom visited me. Yes. Wow. 
so nice see the project guys in fact i've never been here uh, it took me time had left this place in the village and i went to to school see how this place looks like wow that's Mara's project. This is the fish pond construction. See? I had not come here. Look at this. Wow. So guys, you see here, this one I had not seen. This, this is the old one, the new one, the construction of the this, all this place. I left it when they had not put the tiles, but now you see the tiles? Yes, tiles are all over. I'm so impressed with this kind of work. So impressed guys. Also when I was here, they are not installed this kind of uh, lights. You see the lights, the, the solar panels. Not all that he had installed. He had installed some, but some I had not done it. But here, the compound is really shining. So let me take time to pray for them. Yes, let's pray with me, guys. So let's pray. Our kind and loving master in heaven. We want to thank you for this good day that you have given us the gift of life and you have enabled me to be in Amaro's villa. Thank you so much, God, for helping me to reach this place. I've been out in various duties, but by your grace and tender love, you have enabled me to be here. I pray for this villa. I pray for the people working in the villa. Thank you for their gift of life that they are giving them. Bless them abundantly. Each and every day, the kind of work they put, God bless them. As they clean the villa, as they receive visitors, bless them abundantly. Pray for Marwa, who is very far away. Wherever he is, God bless him abundantly and his wife will see you. Be with them, oh God. Bless them abundantly. Give them good health. Help them to work hard so that they come and they procure the same to this place. Thank you, Father, because you are going to see them through. Give them good health, give them love and unity. Let them work as a team. And wherever they are, they may be blessed. Father, remember Rocio, bless her abundantly. Bless the work of her hands and also Maro too. Be with him, O oh God. Thank you as we receive other visitors here. Be with them as they come to the villa. We pray even for those ones who are planning to come to the villa. Give them good health, O oh Lord. Help them to travel back to Africa. Yes, God, so that they come and stay with us here in the villa. We pray for our friends who are on the journey coming. Give them safe journey traveling masses and let them reach this destination. We shall be happy and appreciate you, God. Thank you, Jehovah Lord, for everyone. Who is working within the villa give them their daily needs and help them to have good health father bless each and every person who is working hard in this villa we pray for those our friends outside there who will be watching this video god my sisters and brothers bless them abundantly and let us work as a team uh, father thank you for the gift of life thank you for your tender care thank you for taking care of us we pray, believing and trusting in Jesus' name. Amen. So guys, after making such a short prayer, allow me uh, also check what is happening in the compound. I want to take you to where the pigeons feed. I check whether they get water. Let me see whether there is also uh, the horses. If 
they normally how are they doing and see their health yes because long have come here so guys thank you so much thank you because you love us thank you for watching our videos thank you for supporting my children god bless you outside there and be blessed we are inviting you to come to africa especially in this villa so that uh, uh, god will bless you abundantly so there we have the pigeons over there uh, we have the guinea falls not the pigeons the guinea falls they are making noise they are out uh, they are enjoying the environment down here yes this is where they are the, the guin falls the guin falls are making noise see the guin falls over there yes wow so those are the guin falls yes guys so here i have also the puppies we have the small puppies they are so friendly wow let me check whether they have some how they are they are clean they need to be washed by soap wow guys they are so friendly i don't know their names so i need maybe to wash them by soap so that they don't have uh, the pests wow they are so friendly they are so friendly They are so friendly. I love this. Wow. I love this. So I have to do something about them. I'll wash them by soap, with soap and water so that uh, they become healthy. When they are washed, or I can apply doom. Yeah. I can apply doom. Okay, this is where they sleep. So, so guys, here I'm already here where the cows sleep. This is the cow dung. So I want to check whether the cleaning is being done here so that I advise. Yes, look at this. Uh, this one is clean. I like the way they are doing the cleaning so that the animals enjoy. They don't uh, sleep in a bad place. So this is okay. Yes. So this is the cow pen where the cows sleep and I visited to see whether it's clean for the cows and I found that uh, it's okay. So I'll advise them to make a compost manure using this uh, uh, compost pit. They make a pit then they'll be taking this manure inside, it rots then taken to, to the garden. Yes, I'll advise that. So guys, I told you today I was going around to ensure how things are running here. So I've realized a very important thing here has been here for long. And now Uncle Mo has come. We assist one another. To remove water from this, uh, what is the name of this one? I don't know. Pipe. This pipe that gets water from the, is, this is full of water, you see? So guys, you see here? So there is water. I want to... So there is water inside. There is water inside. 
This thing has been here for long with water. So that's why I had to go around and see what is happening in this compound. So you can see that it has been... Put it down, Bangat. Yes. Akomo is assisting me to remove water from this thing. Then you tie it around. Then we take it care of this thing and keep it. Because it's very expensive. So that's why Congrat Mom had to go around. And this is the work that I've made, guys, today. I've made sure that this thing had water. It was just lying here for long. You see, what is telling me that it has been here for long. I had now to come to see here. because it has been here for long so that's why I'm here to ensure that some things will help and advise the people who are assisting here so now this is what I'm doing with Ankomo I call Ankomo to come and assist Ankomo pull pull down <laughs> the cow is fighting there. <laughs> so guys, this is what we have and I think uh, it needs to be folded. Yeah, I need to fold it so that it is kept. After removing water, it has to be folded. Yeah, I think uh, there is a way of folding. Is this how we fold? Yes, this is how we fold. This is how we fold so that we go and keep it for next time. When they'll be getting water from the river, they'll be able to, you see? We have, that's why I came here to see what's happening. And I thank God I have some job to do. So this is a very important pipe that gets water from the river. Amara is so lucky that he is staying near a river where they can get water even into the fish ponds. Yeah, water can be got to the tank, then right to the fish pond. So I'll advise them to be using this pipe to get water. Yeah, it has taken me time, but uh, all in all, I have to finish, guys, because there is no way I will just do it this way. And you know my hand, I have to do it slowly, because the hand isn't all that okay. Ankomo, come! <laughs> what do you do? Come. No, there is no water. You know my hand. Already the hand cannot be unless you assist uh, me here. You know? That's enough. Guys, so, this congrats mom channel. Subscribe, give a video like, share, comment. Things that are nice here. Yeah, he has come to assist me, guys, because of the hand. There yeah, was the other side. Yes, I've called I him. I have only congrats, mom, doing an amazing job here. Receiving the, the uh, piping from, from decaying it down here. Being, 
almost be get, almost be getting with the predator. Because he's strong, guys. He has just done it very fast. Yeah, he's helping me so that uh, we are able to save his uh, life. Very important. I say, give the video a like. Now guys, it's good. Eh? When you use something, you keep it in for future use. Any day, then this one it will be used. So, and for more, you have done it very nicely. Finally. Okay, so finally, we tried this one. Yes. Hi. And the cap for future use. Yes. This is quite okay, guys. So we will don't finish because this the other one also will have to be tied. This will be for this one. Look at this guy. <laughs> 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 so heavy. <laughs> wow. Wow. It's, come here, Uncle Mom. Yeah. Ebu. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, enjoy the video, guys. So it still has water. Go there the other side. So this is the job of today. It has water, guys. Water. So get the water out. Let the water come down. This way. The water there, 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 there. Water is over. Mm. Oh, that's very strong. Very strong. Very strong. Mm. How comes the So guys, you see, we are untying the pipe, the water, pipe water, so that uh, we can uh, take it back to the house because it's not in use. So we decided to take it back. So this is how we had tied it to get water from the river. We appreciate. So for doing that. You pull, the pulling. You see, you get the pipe outside. Then the uh, water will come out. Okay. 
it. The simplest way of getting water from the pipe, you see. You know, pause. Do here you go. You go. Some of my boyhood that I'm buying. Getting water from my boyhood, guys. To wash the puppy. So this is the water I'll use to wash the puppy. Now let me put here. So what I'm, I'm, I'm lacking is just to get some. So guys, I'm adding water here. We have enough water. So bring here soap. Bring the soap. What is the name of this pack? It doesn't have a name. And this one. So, hello baby, will assist me pour water here and wash the puppy. Hey. <laughs> it's washing like a baby. Stop pouring water. This is how I used to wash the Bosia Boka. And it was so nice. Now that's Bosia Boka. That's from, from Bosia Boka. <laughs> Bosia Boka's puppy. You can see this is soap. Soap. So guys, this is what Congrat Mom has done today to save these puppies from many, 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 many uh, ticks. Pour water. And they love being washed. Stop the water. They love so much, guys. They really love being washed because the ticks are finishing them. Once these dogs grow, they are feeding them and I'll also bring them medicine for worms. I don't want them to have worms. So advise me in the comment section which type of medicine can I buy for these puppies so that they, they, they are, there is a lot of... Oh, where? There, is a, where? there is a lot of uh, worms. <laughs> they love to be washed. They really love to be washed. So you can see what I'm doing. Then the other one wants me to hold it, but I have to finish this one first. You see? You see? Pour water. The baby is assisting me to pour, to, to pour water. They must be ready. <laughs> hey, pour water. <laughs> For water, <laughs> for water. Ah no, 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 no. Have to be clean, clean, clean. Wow, 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 Go. wow. How did you catch this one? Yes, we have to save it. Die down. 
Mr. Pipe! No, don't pour a lot of water. It's to make the body to be smooth and then you add soap. Old was in my watch, why? <laughs> so guys, I've started the exercise in the second one. Uh, so when Maro comes, we give them names. Or he tell me the names he loves so that uh, you see how they have been affected. You see? Applying soap. See guys? I love dogs so much. Pour for me water. Yes. This soap is friendly. It's not so harsh. You cannot use this the best when washing. So if you have dog uh, puppies that uh, have a lot of ticks, you can. Are they ticks? Tell me the comment section. The things that are found in puppies. What is the name? Let me not use that word. Ticks. You know what you call them, so you advise me. See? See how there are many. So today we have saved these dogs, these these puppies. Put the head. Add soap. This is how I used to wash the mother because here, but nowadays it has migrated. Because I'm not at home, when I come back, they eat. I'll be tying it and washing. Put water. for the second time you'll give your comment down below yes how to wash which type of soap is recommended to wash the puppy or pour water pour water but I hope this is the best so happy So whoever will be watching this video we learn how to take care of small puppies by washing them you see like this one is really enjoying so this clean you see it's not even making noise it's enjoying guys wow it is telling me thank you <laughs> <laughs> So happy. Mom loves puppies. Wow, good. Go. Go. No, it needs more water. <laughs> wow. You see? So, guys, I'm so, so, so grateful for taking your time to watch this wonderful activity. Of making the small puppies clean and they have really enjoyed you can see the importance of me going round in I am Marwa's villa so guys it's a blessing to be here God bless you thank you so much thank you for taking your time to watch my videos kindly share the video I have the link down below share in your links to your friends share the video to your different friends and make sure that you subscribe guys let's go back to 50k guys let's reach there god bless you wow we love you thank you see you next time god bless you